All right, so he's going to give me the whole center column. The whole center column. I mean, I, I basically cut him in half like a pair of scissors. He's got all static moves now. There's nothing he can do except one way to win in the whole game. You see this? It's, it's, it's unbelievable people don't see this. All right, I'm going to take my best bet right here. Now, I'm not going I'm, I'm going to make sure I get a double stack or a stack position. There you go, I'm getting Mega 7. He gave me Mega 7. Boom! <laughs> Stacked right there with a big Mega 7. See, I always used to tell my second graders, it's like, 4 is not the most important number in, in uh, Connect 4. 7 is the most important number. Because if you can get 7 formation, you win the game. You get your, your, your stack position. And I'm just going to march him up here. It's irresistible now. Good game. I like this game because it lets the uh, loser go first, because people think that the first person has an advantage. Now he's learning, he's controlling the center. It's a little bit too late though, because I've been playing this game like this for a long time. I'm trying to get a triple horizontal right here. Uh, I'll take it, I'll block it. Alright, that's nice. All right, I'm going to try a little mental trick here. He's going to go here. I'm going to go here. And he's going to force to block his own thing. Didn't like that. Interesting. I'll block it here. Oh, he could have gotten a Mega 7 there. Maybe he's trying to get a Mega 7. Of course, I'm not going to let that happen, if I see it. All right. Okay, I have my cake and eat it, too, right here. Oh, snap! His first win! Nice job. I'm getting exhausted. Can't believe he wants to play. Nine of one. <laughs> this guy's got guts. I always give credit for guts. Come on, center. Alright, I'll cluster then. He still doesn't try to control the center column. Fine, I'll take it. Now look, he's got, he's like, all got static positions now. Fine, this is what I do. I force you up here so I can take that, and it won't waste any of my time. I don't get any wasted move on that. Alright, this will develop a future 2-1 split, probably. Now all I have to do is look for defensive moves to block him. Oh, I can't hit you. Of course you do. Hey, hey, don't block. Hey, boy. All right. Uh, I'll turn that on. I'm talking right now. You gonna play that side downstairs, boy? B? Not that volume. Turn it on. No. All right. This guy just beat me. All right. That's it. Game over. I got my stack position right here. Now I just force it up. Boom, boom. Good game. Oh, come on. You're wearing me down. What is he got like 20 people in a sorority or a sorority in a fraternity or a sorority and they're all just taking turns playing me? This is insane. 
This is all four in a row online. It's pretty good when it doesn't crash. Alright, I'm not giving that to you. He wants to get the triple horizontal. Oh, really? Now you're going to get that side? Alright, I'll develop this and get a... I'm going to get a, a seven right here. I knew he was going to do that. It didn't matter. I wasn't going to let him have it. I got an even better move here. My formation is much stronger. It has a stacked position here, so I'll let him have that. And this is where it gets ugly, my friend. Yeah, look, you got a 2-1 split here, and he's got a triple horizontal here. They, it's kind of a waste. Why waste your move going there when you can really... Either way, you're really only creating a one position right there. So I'm just going to force you up and march you up this column. Good game. That's why upside down 7-7 seven, is the most powerful number in Connect 4. Thank you for playing. Oh, I can't play anymore. Mm. Okay. Where's it at? Right there.